everyone. Today I will be demonstrating how to sample a surface using the 3M Quick Swab. There is another video that shows you exactly how to use this, so we're just going to get right into it. So I am going to release the media down to the swab. I am going to go ahead and take this out. So you can see we have our swab there. So I am gonna sample the floor. All right, so you can see the swab here. And let's see if you are able to see this. We're gonna sample this area right here. All right, you can see we're getting it, turning it around real good. All right. Next, we are going to take our swab and we're gonna put it back in its container. And we're just gonna give it a, a good shake to get those cells off of the swab. All right, and into our microbiological media there, all right? Now what we're gonna do is we're just going to take our swab, we get on SPC media. We won't be using the quadrant method, we're just gonna be using the zigzag method this time. Okay. So you take your Petri dish and you just swab it like that. And then we are going to cap it. Now be sure that you label this really good because what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a Clorox wipe and we're going to clean that area and then we're gonna swab again to demonstrate the effectiveness of using a sanitizer. So be sure that you label this really good. What we're gonna do, you're gonna take those Clorox wipes that are located in your kit. You are going to open it up. You're gonna just take one out and we're gonna go back to that same area that we swamped. You can see I've kind of put the chair near it so that you can see it. All right, so it's this area right here. So we're just gonna wipe this area. We're gonna give it a few seconds to kind of dry and then we're gonna come right back to that same area. Be sure that you throw away your Clorox wipe in the biohazard bag that was in your kit. So be sure that you do that. While that is drying, we're gonna also take that same swab that we just had, and we are going to streak it on our XLD media, okay? So that we can see what we're doing. So again, you just take your swab and you're just gonna do that little zigzag motion because we only care about whether or not it's positive or negative for the microorganism that is specific for this media. Okay, so we are gonna take that plate, be sure you label it with your name. Um, be sure that you label it with your name and the date that you actually took the sample for those who will be bringing it to the lab for us to incubate, okay? All right. So you want to have your other 3M swab ready. So this is the swab that will be used to swab the now sanitized area of the floor. So again, you do need a new swab in order to do that. So we're just going to go ahead and prepare it. Right now you can see that the media is there with the swab. And you can see we have a new SPC um, Petri dish okay, that we will use. All right, so now that that area has dried, 
we're going to take our swab and I will lower the hammer again so that you can see. All right, there we go. Okay. So we're just gonna swab that area. Lower it just a little bit so you can see. All right, there we go. That same area. So make sure you're going to the exact same area where you um, use the sanitizing wipes. All right. So now we are going to take our swab. Get it in there just like we did the first time. Give it a little shake to knock all of those cells off into the media. And again, you can also use a 3M Petri film with this as well, but we're just streaking on media so that you can get practice with streaking and using the swabs at the same time. All right, so we are going to take our swab. We're gonna take our Petri dish with the SPC media. So you'll be using only SPC for this. And you are just going to streak as such. Using the zigzag motion, right? Afterwards, you will take your the lid, place it on there, and we will incubate these for uh, 24 hours at 37 degrees Celsius to see what we get. Again, please make sure that the swabs that you are using, you place it in the biohazard bag that came in the kit that you received. Thanks everybody, bye-bye.